Hey family, welcome to Ohana House. I'm Star. And in this video, I am going to take you on the journey of redesigning our home office. Um, it is about time. We've been both working from home at the same time for now over six months. And it's finally time to really give our office in TLC. We didn't know it would be like this for this long, so it kind of has, has been on the back burner. But we we're about to change that starting now i am at sherwin williams i'm going to pick out some paint for our office I, I already have an idea of what colors i want but i want to check in person to make sure that the colors look the same that they do online and obviously the same on the wall as well so i want to show you what colors i'm thinking about then we'll go back home and i'll show you what the office looks like right now and also my vision for the, the direction that I am going in for the design. So let's go. I actually was talking when I was filming this, but I was like whispering because I was in the store. So I just thought I'd do a voiceover instead. Here I am just trying to choose between the green color that I want for the office feature wall. And so I just went through a process of narrowing and I also wanted to choose a warm white to pair with the green to brighten up the room and the green would provide the contrast. We also purchased a paint sprayer to use with this project, mainly for the feature wall because we were using vertical slats, so it would have been hard to roll it or brush the paint on. Um, but we also used the sprayer to spray the other walls as well. Here is what the office is looking like so far. Old furniture that we just put in here and gray walls, which you know that I hate if you've been watching me for a while. Here is my mood board of sorts, my hood mood board. Okay, so the first thing we did was just clear out all of the existing furniture out of the room. We left the table there because we're gonna use this table as our workbench. And also we're gonna move this table to the basement to be our permanent workbench for our projects going forward as well. I actually have a more detailed video on my channel about how we did the feature wall. So I'll leave a link to that in the description box and also a card at the top right hand corner of this video if you want to watch how we did that. 
in more detail. The paint colors that we used were Artichoke by Sharon Williams and Alabaster by Sharon Williams. So we wanted our office to be a two-person office and neither one of us liked the idea of having a desk facing the wall, which would be the best way to maximize space for a two-person office. And so instead of getting a traditional desk, I decided to purchase a dining room table that I could use as a two-person desk that we would position in the center of the room. So I'll leave a link to this mid-century modern table that we chose to be a good desk for the both of us. I also decided to replace the gray sofa that was in the room. It just didn't fit the vibe that I was going for. So I replaced it with this beautiful camel colored sofa that David is putting together in this clip. So this is a pretty cool detail in the chair legs. Look at that leg. It's pretty dope, right? Detail, clear. This is gonna look really good. Stay tuned. So we are preparing to put up the wall sconces that are going to go above the bookshelf. The cool thing about these, and don't mind the very short curtains in the back, that I'm returning those, I got the wrong height. But um, the good thing about these is that they are battery powered. So we are preparing to hang these above 
this bookshelf here and don't mind all the crap on there they're not out yet um but yeah so i'll show you that You say it'll be a quick job. It would be. No, like like a lot quicker than this one. I've got to measure it. In. Okay. Like the look of it? We also turned our old Ikea Calyx bookshelf into this beautiful green condensa. So if you have not seen that furniture makeover, I'll also leave a link to that video in the description box as well. And this is how everything turned out. I was trying to strike the balance between feminine and masculine. And I think that we ended up with elements of both here. And of course, green is my favorite color. So I really enjoy our office. I have been thinking about whether I wanted to keep the wall green or change it to a more neutral color. But for now, the green is working. So we will keep it as is. Let me know what you think about this makeover in the comment section below and subscribe for more home decor DIY and home inspiration videos. If you have not done so already, like this video. And until next time, love star.